let me do a rapid fire round with you and on the rapid fire i want to ask you who's your uh, favorite current day politician i won't answer it because Why? current day politician not one there are several for several reasons one i like for something another i like for something else and so on so i can't name one in particular acha one opposition leader who you really have respect for current day again i won't be able to answer it there are few people there are few people oh, come on this is are you spoiled for choice this, this is this is a country of 140 crore people you can't choose one 140 crore and therefore i can't choose one <laughs> there are just too many okay uh, what does nirmala sitaraman uh, uh, do in her free time listen to a lot of music cooking and read and twitter wars on the side yes no that's actually time consuming but it's worth the fight and uh, during elections uh, uh, how 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 do you want to take the message of your government to the people of india well i'll be campaigning i'll be going to a lot of nukkad sabhas i'll also be attending a lot of media events um and going with the candidates like tomorrow i'll be going for rajiv chandra chandrashekar's campaign in tiruvananthapuram so yes i'll be on the campaign trail so so let me let me ask you uh, as as a woman finance minister were you at the receiving end uh, uh, of a little bit of peer pressure a little bit of competitiveness does it happen to uh, women in uh, political parties and women even in the cabinet yes it does yes yes it does it does happen and uh, backstabbing also uh, well i don't know about that because i'm still surviving <laughs> <laughs> no but yes there's a lot of um, at least the social media has become very powerful a tool in the hands of everyone true democracy i can't complain but it is so used easily readily to target women politicians women in any field i would think but i think we'll have to just survive it we've just got to ignore it and if you start responding there's just no end to it